Hello, we are Thierry Xu, Anton Chubin, and Tony Sempere, and today we're presenting International Business Cor Machine Corporation, or better known as ABM. It's an American multinational technology company with operates in over 170 countries. ABM manufactures and markets computer hardware, middleware, and software, and offers hosting and consulting services in areas ranging from mainframe computers to nanotechnology. The company AVM is an also major research organization holding the record for most patterns generated by business for 40, 24 consecutive years. Founded in New York in, two, in 1911 by Charles R. Flynn as a computing, tabulating, and recording company, this was the marriage of four big companies and now is one of the biggest multinationals in the world in technology. Hello, I am Anton Shubin and I'd like to tell you about main IBM products. Initially, IBM started with hardware and suppliers of mainframe computers, but later companies shifted its focus on business software and services. So there are three main IBM products. First one is IBM Watson Analytics. It's data analysis and visualization center, which helps customers to analyze their business data and figure out what drives their business. Second product is IBM Watson Content Hub. It is content manager, which helps business to integrate products in web application or websites. Uh, it, will create, it will upload, systemize, and take all information about uh, your product in web resources. The third and final one is IBM MAAS 360 with Watson. It is web cloud which unifies all business data from different devices such as PC, laptop, computers and others. Firstly, it let customers to look after business during trips. Secondly, it shows how different events can affect your business. And thirdly, it let manager to, uh, to manage business from different devices. So next part is part of my colleague, Jerry. Okay, I'm Jerry Shea. And in terms of financial perspective, and we, uh, IBM announced its Q4 and the whole year of 2016 financial reports in this January. And we can see this, and our Q4 revenue is 21.77 billion US dollar. And even though it's lower than which uh, which in the same time in 2015. However, our net profit is 4.5 billion US dollar. It's higher than which in 2015. And it means that our company is well operating and we have better ability to lower our operating costs than before. And besides, an EPS is an important indicator to show profitability and we expect that uh, IBM will reach 13.8 uh, per, share, per share US dollar, exceeding uh, the estimate of 13.74 from Wall Street analysts. And also, and our market price rose 21% in, uh, in 2016 in the US stock market. So uh, it means that uh, the investor believe our company in the long run will start to grow. And finally, we truly believe that IBM can make the world changed. Join IBM and fulfill your dream. Thank you for your attention.